Okay, um, hello everybody, uh, it's William Jeremy, welcome to my channel. So, yeah, today's video gonna be a little bit different um, from what you're used to, but I hope you um, just find it as, just as meaningful. Um, in fact, um, this is like a, like about a personal project for me. I want to start a new series about a sort of, um, like, personal memoir. Um, for those of you guys who, like, already know, this channel has always been about digital art. Like, um, exploring, like, creativity um, through the, um, like, pixel, through the traditional art, through all sort of medium. But um, today I'm introducing you something new, um, something more personal to me. Um, yeah, I, I, I think I already post a post at the community and uh, also on uh, Twitter, now it's called X now. Um, I uh, recently experienced a profound loss. My mum got like cancer three or four years ago and she fought for uh, for it bravely fought with it bravely uh, but she recently passed away and um, in a wake of her passing I've been left with not a lot of her things um, but just left with memories but but as I said earlier, as I went through her things, um, this kind of emotion and like a stark realization sort of struck me because she didn't leave much behind. Um, not only just like her own memories, her stories, but like my story, the story around um, around her. Um, of course, she's um, like very private person. Okay, she seldom like go to parties, um, and she's like a family guy. Okay, um, my mom like really cherish family um, but I realized that there's just so much about her life that remain untold and maybe I will never going to know about and um, yeah so um, she seldom talk about it even in her last days um, she just refused to talk about all these things um, like the story uh, that happened before story happened to her and then she got some sort of like it like seizure um, so just maybe the tumor just got into her brain and she began to can't remember things and even can't recognize people so I think it's kind of a sort of a struck me of um, how difficult it is to actually leave something behind like truly leave something behind especially something like intangible like memories but I think Yet that's the invaluable thing in life. The most, like, because everything that you know, when we live in this world, we may cherish money, fame, all that. But to be honest, I recently realized that all this doesn't really matter that much. That's the reason why I, like, add a more personal touch to this channel because I'm also, I'm my mom's son, so I'm also a really private person. So. Uh, um, that's the reason why you watch my previous like videos before I even make say VRM model and like project that on my face and do all that 
and refuse to talk about anything personal. Just you know, just doing some like faceless tutorial, because I'm also a very private person. But, but my mom's、um, passing sort of struck me of how difficult to leave things, especially these invaluable memories and stories. So then also、um, struck me that I have to like record or. Or try to record or or find that to to sort of grasp that thing before it actually goes away from my memory because the memory will fade. Then I believe it's like in a in a kids、uh, anime that say that、uh, um like kids movie when the person like when. Like nobody actually rem remember that person that、uh, that person is really、um, passing away, and I just realized that I have to recall this thing. This things when the memory is fresh, I'm trying to recall things, and、um, you know,、uh, I also tweeted, like write a post just a, a few days ago. I think the. Most hard part about facing your loved ones、uh, passing away is that it's not that that exact moment, but it's the sort of a hardship that you have to endure, like the rest of your life. Because when you go to some places, you realize that you know、uh, you went this place with your loved one, something like that. All this memory just come back. And I want to sort of、uh, face that memory and grasp it, and sort of、uh, digitize it. And、um, sort of like digital memoir,、uh, if you will. So that's the reason I I want to, like decided to start a new series、um, in this channel. Because you know this channel is like called、uh, Learn Digital Art, so everything about digital art. So I think maybe this can loosely be classified as digital art because this is a kind of a digital memoir. Like in Harry Potter, you got some of the memory out and you know, store that in, like you crystallize it into a uh, uh, container. I'm sort of like crystallize that. And make a digital memoir. Um, so I know this series may not get a lot of views, um, but that doesn't matter. Um, you know, I sort of treat this as a form of digital art or digital legacy. Um, and um, maybe you know my kids or my friends or. Whoever you are in this world, when you will re-、uh, actually watch this video, maybe one day, you know. Um. Yeah, absolutely. Someday I will be、um, passing away as well, so I actually leave some memory or digital legacy as form of art behind. And um. So, yeah. It won't just about my journey as a digital artist, but about the person who I am, and share the true stories about my life, and maybe delve a little bit about my loved ones, my mom's, um, like untold stories. And I want to make this series. A way of how I remember them, and maybe they will be how people remember me. Okay, maybe you watch this video like maybe many years, maybe decades later, and I'm like long gone, and、um, yeah, maybe I can make this my legacy, and、uh, you can use this to remember me as well. So,、uh, yeah. Um, 
this is unscripted as you know it's just you know just a uh, talk with the guys and when the memory comes uh, we just record this so maybe you will see me like go um, somewhere else like in the street and, and I record because the memory just struck me um, yeah and I think memory is the really interesting thing it's like a fleeting moment in life that sort of like struck you and then you realize that and I want to use like a, this digital format to as a medium to store that and hopefully defies the time okay um, I know yeah I know this is like a really departure of my original content my normal content um, but I believe that art digital art is also a form of art it's all about expression so art without story without like a meaning behind this it's a, it's a, it's a sort of meaningless it's just some like craft craftsmanship I know my art is not like great in that sense when, when you, you look at my skill I'm, I'm like, you know, come on I just learned art for less than a year okay and it's just my long term like dreams like my, my kids dreams my childhood dreams so they just like pursue it fearlessly um so uh yeah so i believe this also loosely counted as an expression about like conveying my emotions and capturing that moment and maybe i will create as I recollect all this like tiny little detail about my life, about my mom or my loved one's life, um, maybe I will like create art based on these real things that sort of like defies time and express my, like convey my emotion, like capture maybe some moments. Um, I want, you know, doing some new form of experiment like merge my personal reflection like personal experience and merge that with the creation of um, this chart yeah so yeah i invite you all to join this um like my personal really personal journey um hopefully maybe it will inspire you to think about your own stories and the memories, the um, the cherish thing that you, the thing that you cherish in life, you want to preserve, and how you can, you know, if you watch this channel, maybe you also want to learn digital art. I and I encourage you and I invite you to use that creativity, to, to sort of use it as a creative outlet to combine your own story to tell your own story and um, yeah I know it's a pretty messy um, speech but um, yeah thank you thank you for always supporting me um, supporting this channel and um, take this journey with me and um, yeah you know, you know the drill don't fail, or don't forget to like subscribe hopefully and if you're interested in this kind of content and um, always keep creating keep remembering and keep um, um, you know enjoy your life yeah see you next video